Hey Libra, Kaisha here. Thank you so much for joining me on my channel, The Butterfly Effect Tarot. Huge, huge shout out to my day ones, my foundation subscribers, all of my new subscribers. Thank you. I appreciate you. And if you're checking me out for the first time and this reading resonates with you, or I as a reader resonate with you, I encourage you to please share, like, and of course, don't be shy, subscribe. Okay, Libra, you know the drill. Take what resonates, discard the rest. Don't try to force it to fit. If you want a personal reading, all that information and more is located in the description box. I'm going to jump right into your reading because it's getting late and I got to get up early in the morning. Spirit, thank you for your clear and concise messages. I'm here and I understand them. This is a reading for the beautiful Libra Collective. What messages do you have for Libra that is for their highest good? Of battle i am a devoted warrior of the universe so you have battle but it came out in reverse it's my deck in reverse oh. okay, hold on wait, no. let me do this again because I believe my deck's in the verse. Let's give it a good shuffle. Just want to make sure that the deck is not in reverse here. Okay, there we are. Okay, so you have forecasts. Okay, I am the oracle. My intuitive insights flow freely. You have divine, okay, the little star. My inner child is whole and complete. And this one came out in reverse. And you have starlight. My inner vision guides me to my higher purpose. And this came out in reverse. Whoever I'm speaking to, you are highly intuitive. You don't have to be a reader, but you're highly intuitive. You just know things. Mm -hmm. and you don't know how you know them you just do yeah you may have some people a little bit shook of you because you always seem to pick up on what's going on with them or you just always seem to know libra mm -hmm. what i like whoever i'm speaking to what i like about your energy is you just this is how you are <laughs> <laughs> yeah you just let it flow you do not try to suppress yourself that's good okay that's really good let's clarify let's go under the surface here someone could really like green okay or jade someone could be of asian descent here spirit please clarify there's something here about being in harmony with yourself Mm -hmm. it's beautiful you could do yoga you're very flexible mm -hmm. i'm hearing contortionist for someone like you're one of those people that can like bend your body like you have no bones <laughs> must be nice because <laughs> i can't do that spirit please clarify please clarify the oracle mm-hmm Libra, intuitively, you knew that you weren't going to have some new beginning with someone. Mm -hmm. um, it's like you were giving to someone. Ah, let me see. You were giving to someone. Uh, even though you knew you may not end up with anything out of it. Libra, I feel like you knew that somebody did not know who they were or what they wanted. They weren't as aware of themselves as you are someone could have been having a midlife crisis or identity crisis i feel like libra you could have been just trying to show someone love mm -hmm. it's like you were trying to love them back to themselves but uh, i feel like intuitively you knew you couldn't really do that mm -hmm. it's an inside job they have to do it themselves you can't find someone for them 
Spirit, please clarify Ace of um, Earth in reverse. You could have been dealing with an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or another air sign. Yes. Uh, it's like you knew that you were investing in something that really wasn't going to go anywhere, Libra. But you, I feel like you cared about someone here. You really did. Please clarify Nine of Earth. You could have been investing in someone for a long time too. Mm -hmm. Oh man. Libra, you put a lot of energy. You put you worked, you worked in this, okay? You put a lot of work in with somebody. You got seven of coins and eight of coins. But it was like to no avail. Like you, you... Libra, I feel like this was a lesson for you as well. Like you cannot find someone for them, okay? Please clarify. And I also feel like, hold on, let me see this first. Can I get ace of, um, one on ace of air in reverse? We've got two aces in reverse here. So it's like things that were supposed to be a new beginning, right? It, it just never happened. It never, it's like a failure to launch. Mm -hmm, yeah, because this person, you were trying to work with someone who has no idea who they are, what they want for their life, what they're about where they're going. This person is very distorted. And for some of you, you kept giving to someone and showing them love and being there for them and being supportive. And they were a whole bitch or an asshole. I'm just going to say a plain, right? With the queen of swords in reverse, you could have been dealing with a sociopath. Yeah. They don't really care about anybody because they don't know how to. Yeah. Yeah. Your energies did not match here, right? I could be speaking to someone from um, the LGBTQ community. Hi, babies, right? This could be two feminine energies. It's like you tried, you tried, you tried some more, and then you tried again, Libra, with someone. And it was just like, what the fuck am I doing here? Like, this is not going anywhere. Someone seemed to be stuck in their ways. They're malicious, they're deceitful, they're narrow-minded. They have a bad temper, they have a bad attitude. They're quick to cut you down. And you just kept loving this person. Libra, I feel like intuitively you knew that something was up with this person, right? Now, you could have sensed or picked up on that maybe this person was abused or this person went through some things, right? But they never really processed them or they didn't process them the right way. So it's like someone that's abused, they're hurt. They do their healing. They could speak to a counselor or... or learn healthier ways to deal with anxiety and all of that stuff or depression and they choose to be a good person this person decided that they're going to walk around with a chip on their shoulder and they're just going to throw hands at everybody right it's everybody's fault what happened to them and libra i feel like you really felt for this person and you just you kept trying with them you kept trying to show this person that you're not going to hurt them you love them you're there for them you're there to support them and still this person is fragmented. They're all over the place. But it is, it's deep hurt here, right? And it, and that's why Spirit's like, you can't find, you can't find them for them, right? The pieces of this person that left so that they could just cope with everyday life, you cannot get it back for them. They had to do that themselves. Intuitively, you knew that, Libra. But I feel like you just love someone and you under, you understood, right? And I feel, oh, Libra, I want to give you a huge hug. <laughs> Aww. This is beautiful energy. It's like, I know you're hurting. I know you're lashing out because this happened to you. I'm not going to hurt you. I'm not going anywhere. But at some point in time, you had to call a spade a spade, right? It's like, I, I can't let you hurt me because you're hurt. Spirit, please clarify. Divine in reverse. So let me go deeper here first. Spirit, please clarify. Divine in reverse. Someone could have lost a child or they found out that they are infertile. Someone was forced to give up a child. They could have gotten pregnant at a young age and they were forced to give up a child for adoption and it just... They were just mad at everybody because of that, you know? 
there are inner inner child wounds here mm -hmm. yeah someone lacks self-love Libra, I feel like you realize that with somebody, right? And that's why you were so patient with them. I'm speaking to the same sex couple here, right? This is two feminine energies. Some of you could have been dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Mm -hmm. Or another air sign. Spirit, please clarify to a fire. Yeah, you could have lived with this person, shared a home with them. Yeah, but you realize that this person was, it's like they didn't have anything to offer you because they didn't have anything to offer themselves. Mm -hmm. This person is very codependent. They just walk around with this huge ass chip on their shoulder, Libra, I'm not going to lie. Right? They act entitled. They're overly cautious to the point of being aggressive. And it's because they don't trust anybody. Mm -mm. This person may feel like nobody loves them. Somebody could have been given up for adoption as well. But someone feels like they... They're hard to love or no one loves them. And I, I want to ball my eyes out right now because, because of what happened to them in childhood. And I feel like, Libra, you saw that. Spirit, please clarify. Please clarify love in reverse. Yeah. This person couldn't give you anything sincere, Libra, because they they really didn't know how to be that way with themselves. This person really believes that they're not lovable or they can't trust people or, you know. They don't really. It's like the depth of your emotion that you felt for them. Or how deep you thought about them, how highly you regarded them. They don't feel like that with other people. They don't think that way. It's it's not that deep for them because it's like I'm not going to get invested because they're going to throw me away like trash, just like what happened to me when I was younger or in adolescence or, you know, early adulthood. So I'm not going to get invested. I'm not going to let this person be on my head stressing me out and I'm not going to offer them anything serious. But because of this person's codependency, Libra, they do have issues with being alone or, and issues with rejection. So I feel like if you guys would break up, this person would come back and love bomb you because there was a, a dread, a fear, okay? They're absolutely terrified of being alone. Mm -hmm. Even though they could not give you what you were giving them, they couldn't exercise equal reciprocity with you. They're so guarded. Spirit, please clarify five of... Please clarify five of air in reverse. Mm -hmm. You started to see this, Libra. Mm -hmm. That someone was very unhappy. Mm -hmm. And it doesn't, it didn't matter how much stability you provided them in their life. It didn't matter how much you showed them that you're not going anywhere, right? You're not going to abandon them like everybody else. It still didn't make them happy because that's it's an inside job. Happiness comes from you. And you started to see that. Intuitively, you knew that already. Hmm. Spirit, please clarify. Please clarify Starlight in reverse. Yeah. This person is just unhappy inside. Okay. Some of you are dealing with someone who has, um, they could be a manic depressive. So they go through bouts of depression, right? They could be a seasonal depression, right? When it gets 
um, like when it gets cold, they get depressed, right? When the, the seasons change, they get depressed. But you tried so hard, Libra, to let someone know that you love them and you'll always be there for them. But you did not, you didn't get it back, right? And this person was just in this energy of, I'm, I'm not going to show you love. I'm not going to open up to you and let you in so you can hurt me like everybody else. But I'm going to take everything that you're giving to me, though, because it makes me feel good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Libra, I, I feel like you realize that you had to stop putting someone on a pedestal here mm -hmm. and stop making them the star of your show. Yeah. You realize that you, you can only help this person so much, but they have to do the rest of the work. Like their happiness, you, you can't make someone happy. Especially this energy? No. Mm -mm. This is going to take professional. This is a professional job here. Someone. This is somebody who needs like to see a therapist or a counselor, do energy work. They have to be an active participant in their own rescue, in their own healing. And they weren't doing that. And you realize that they need to get it together. This person doesn't want to let you go, though. Spirit, please clarify. Um, it's like they're unhappy and they don't know what to do about it. Please clarify King of Earth in reverse. Yeah. They know they need to do something about it, but they don't know what to do. Please clarify four of air. They're in their head. Yeah. This person as well, they have a fear of abandonment. So for some of you, you are dealing with someone who was, if you get in an argument, they're quick to be like, okay, we're done. I'm gone. I break up with you. This is over. Because they're so terrified, Libra, of you leaving them. Right? So they had to do it first. And they realize that they need to get it together. They need to let that go. They can't do stuff like that anymore. Spirit, please clarify. Seven of water in reverse. Yeah. This person is learning how to. They know they need to let things go. They know you didn't hurt them. They know they need to stop walking around with this chip on their shoulder. I feel like this person knows they're not going to find anybody like you. Who was so invested in showing them that you, you can be a safe place for them. A safe space. But uh, Libra, at some point in time, you got to this place, you got to this, uh, it's like you got to this place where you're like, well, who's my safe place, right? I can't just keep giving to you and showing you love and you're not showing it back to me. That's abuse and I'm not going to be a martyr, right? This person, they know that they need to find a way to bring harmony and balance in their life. Mm -hmm. They also need to learn how to be more patient with themselves. It's because this healing that this energy you're dealing with, Libra, it's going to take time. This is not an overnight job, okay? It's going to take time. Real change takes time. Because they have some things that they are holding on. Deep-rooted emotional wounds here that they've been holding on to. They do need professional help. They need someone to, to guide them in how to release it, how to process it. You did all you could do, Libra, you know? You, you really did. Hats off to you. Hmm. Spirit, any more messages? Any more messages for Libra? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. The worst is over, Libra. 
I feel I feel like it, as much as it hurts you to have to let this person go or to separate from this person, you did what was best for you. Now you have energy to pour into yourself. Whoever I'm speaking to, this person was very malicious when they didn't get what they wanted. You had to learn how to set boundaries with them. Mm -hmm. Right? You had to learn how to turn off your tap of love. Right? You had to learn how to stop pouring into, into people who weren't pouring into you. Regardless, like you can't feel sorry for people. You can feel compassion, yes, right? Showing up as the queen of cups here, but but you can't feel sorry for people. Especially people who are not trying to do anything to help themselves. All right? Hmm. Libra, you had to learn how to set boundaries with someone who you love dearly, but they did not, they didn't show you that love back. And you made a good decision for yourself. And intuitively, you know that. Libra, this is what I have for you. If any of this resonates, smash that like button. If not, that's cool another time. With that being said, you have yourself a fantastic morning, noon, or night. And I will catch your beautiful energy on the flip side. Bye.